I am getting ready to show you something and I'm going to trust that you won't judge me. What you see right here is a combination of empty boxes, full boxes, all of the tumblers and mugs that PYD Life has sent me. I've taken them out, I've unboxed them, I've numbered them, and I've included them in my Amazon storefront. Now that you've seen my little mess right here, let me tell you how this could be beneficial to you. Hello everyone and welcome to Crafting with Delanda. It's me again, Delanda, and thank you so much for joining me today. As you may or may not know, I have done several collaborations with PYD Life. I have unboxed four of their sublimation machines. I recently unboxed the newest PYD Life oven that I told you is just so super cute and easy to use. Well, PYD Life has agreed to sponsor a portion of my 100K giveaway, and I am over the moon with excitement about that. What they have agreed to do is a sublimation tumbler bundle, but I don't want them to just send any sublimation tumblers. I want you to be able to vote in that process about which tumblers will be included in the giveaway. So what I've done is I've unboxed all 19 of the tumblers and mugs that I received from PYD Life. I have included them in my Amazon storefront so you can get a better look at them. And all I need from you is just to list the number down in the, in the comments below of the one you love the most. I will share my two personal favorites, but I don't want to sway your opinion or your decision about that. But I do want to be honest and upfront with you about the ones that I really like the most. At the end of this video, if you find it helpful, please consider liking the video, subscribing to my channel, and turning on the bell for notifications because I do upload new content every single week. Now, without further ado, let's look at the 19 mugs and tumblers that PYD Life has sent. And remember, if you wanna get a closer look at them, they are linked in my Amazon storefront in my PYD Life favorites. Okay, so without further ado, let's get started. Tumbler number one is a 20 ounce with a sliding lid. Any tumbler that you see that has a star on it right here, that means it will fit in the Cricut mug press. Let me show you what I mean by that. I have my Cricut mug press right here. If I wanted to sublimate this one in the Cricut mug press, of course I would remove the lid right here and I could slide this in just like that and my mug press closes. So any of these you see with a star, I know will fit at least somewhat in the Cricut mug press, okay? So let's look at tumbler number two. Tumbler number two is called the Straight Fatty. It's also 20 ounces. This one does not have a handle, so that's what makes it different. It also has the sliding lid and it comes with a straw. The lid just comes off like this and you can see what the inside looks like. Okay, so you can see this one will also fit in the Cricut mug press. Tumbler number three is called the Skinny Slim. It's 12 ounces. It will fit in the Cricut mug press. I put a B here because it comes with the rubber bottom. This one also comes with a straw, I think, and it has an interchangeable lid, which I think is kind of awesome. So you, it comes with two lids. It comes with this lid, and it also comes with this lid that you can twist on. Okay, so, and that's what the inside looks like. So if you wanted to put a small can in here, that's the purpose of tumbler number three. Tumbler number four is a kid's tumbler, and it's a 17 ounces and it will fit in the Cricut mug press. It is a twist off lid, okay? And it comes with the pop, uh, the spout that you can lift like this, or you can use the, the option right here. And that is that. If you wanna get a closer look, remember you can see any of these in my Amazon storefront. Tumbler or mug number five is a color changing mug. Let me show you what that looks like. It is 11 ounces. It will fit in the Cricut mug press. It's activated by heat.
Okay. Tumbler number six is 18 ounces and it has a leak proof lid. So this is good for someone who's on the go, who drinks coffee. You know, if you have it in the car, you're not having to worry about, you know, your coffee spilling out because the lid is leak proof. Tumbler number seven is called a sublimation glass can. It's 15 ounces. It is pre-drilled with a hole down here at the bottom for anyone who is interested in making those um, snow globe tumblers. It has a bamboo lid and it comes with a straw. So it is double walled so that you can see, hopefully you can see that there's like a glass within a glass, okay? Tumbler number eight is a sublimation glass can. It's 18 ounces. It will fit in the Cricut mug press. It comes with this gray lid and it feels like rubber. Um, it does come with a straw. Number nine is this really cute 12 ounce mug. It does have a silver rim. It's very lightweight and cute to me. It's just it's so cute. I love it. Um, this one is different from this 11 ounce mug. You can see it's a little bit shorter. So that is that one. Number 10 is a travel mug. This one, of course, will fit in the Cricut mug press. It's 22 ounces. Does have a handle. Number 11 is the 17 ounce water bottle. And of course it has, you know, the, the little handle you can carry right here. It has this pop open spout right here at the top. It is twist off. Okay. And it does have a straw on the inside that you can connect. Number 12 is a 22 ounce car tumbler. Um, and it, do, it also has that leak proof lid here at the top. Number 13 is called a skinny straight. It's 16 ounces. It will fit in the Cricut mug press. And it also is a kind of like a twist off. Number 14 is a 34 ounce tumbler. It looks a lot like number 12. It's pretty much the same thing. This one is just taller. Number 15 is a 30 ounce straight tumbler. And um, this one is big. It's really, it's really big and tall. Um, and it comes with a straw. And you can see how, how tall it is. It's a twist off. Okay. It doesn't have the leak proof lid. Number 16 is a 30 ounce water bottle. It's very similar to this one. Pretty much the same concept. This one is just 17 ounces. This one is 30 ounces. Number 17 is the 25 ounce car tumbler. So this one reminds me of this, okay? So it's just a little bit taller. Number 18 is the silver glitter 20 ounce tumbler. Comes with a straw, okay? So it's a standard tumbler. You know, you be careful with your sublimating with, because of this space right here, all right? Number 19, the pink glitter 20 ounce tumbler. This is what it looks like from the other side. I think it's so pretty and it has a straw and the lid so now for my favorite <laughs> if you believe it or not the two that are my favorites are this one right here i think this is so unique because i drink the little small sodas and i think this will fit nicely in here i'm actually going to grab one and see if i can see if it fits in there let me go grab one Okay, so back to this one. It will fit one of the small cans. You know, if you know me, I love Dr. Pepper. It fits nicely right in there and I can just close it and this will keep my drink cool. So I like that and I love the fact that it comes with the rubber bottom. I love the rubber bottoms. I also like this one right here because I drink a lot of coffee and normally when I drink it, I'm in a rush and I don't want to worry about burning myself with the coffee. I like the fact that it has this handle. I love that leak proof um, lid. I just, I think it's so cute. Now I do think that I would have a problem sublimating this, but I still love it. Okay. And there are actually two more. I know I said two, but there are two more that I really, really love. I also love this glitter tumbler. I think it's just so pretty. It was hard to just choose two. I know I only said two, but I love that one. And I also love 
just how cute this one is because I think it's just so dainty. It makes me want to just like drink it with my pinky up like that. But anyway, we di I, I don't want to digress. So if you found this helpful, please consider liking the video, subscribing to my channel, and turning on the bell for notifications because I do upload new content every single week. Don't forget to leave a comment below and let me know which one you would love an opportunity to win. And I will make sure to give all of that data to PYD Life so that we can make some informed decisions as we get closer to the 100K giveaway. Thank you so much for joining me today. And thanks for watching. Bye.